to perform our functions. Honorable Speaker, I think there is a very serious problem in the national treasury of this country. The national treasury of this country behaves as if it is the treasury of the executive of this country. I think it is time we come up with an independent institution that disperses funds to the three arms of government and to the two levels of government so that these monopolistic tendencies of national treasure, the determining who to allocate resources as and when it pleases them, comes to an end, Honorable Speaker. Honorable Speaker, this Senate performs a very critical function. There is no way over 374 billion will be dispersed to county governments and fail to disperse funds that will oversee the utilization of those resources, Honorable Speaker. We therefore demand that without further delay, National Treasury releases the funds that are due for operations for the Senate liaison offices and for the salaries of our staff. Honorable Speaker, on the matter of the PS Foreign Affairs, uh, Honorable Speaker, it is this disappointing. We as a continent, as AU, they are fighting to make sure that we have no borders in order to increase the volume of trade and enable us as Africans to exploit the natural resources we have. But we are here castigating a delegation who are already in parliament. Honorable Speaker, where was the Principal Secretary for Foreign Affairs when those people traveled from Somaliland? Landed in JKIA? They were already walking around in the city of Nairobi? And they only found it necessary as a matter of loyalty to increasing trade within Africa and within African nations to make sure that the resources that are available in Kenya, that the benefits that Kenya can derive cannot be lost to Europe, Honorable Speaker. I think it is time we have a conversation on how we really want to make trade easy for African countries. Honorable Speaker, I agree with the Senator for Vega and, uh, and the rest uh, of the Senator and Senator Wambua that the Committee for Defense and Foreign Affairs should actually summon that piece. And it should not only appear before the Committee of Foreign Relations and Defense, Honorable Speaker, it must appear on the Committee of the Whole of the House, Honorable Speaker, because we have other issues we would also like to find out on how that ministry is being run, Honorable Speaker. Honorable Speaker, I submit. Senator Eddy.